if cos theta we are given this one minus tan square theta by 2 upon 1 plus tan square theta by 2. But tan theta by 2 which is given to us with this value in the root 1 minus e upon 1 plus e into 10 5 by 2 this value. If I substitute value 10 theta by 2 here, the cos theta we are calculating is 1 minus 10 square theta by 2. Tan theta by 2 is the square of this. And if it will give us 1 minus e upon 2 plus e square root of 10 theta by 2 into 10 square pi upon 2 divided by the denominator we have 1 plus 10 square theta by 2 again. So this is 1 minus e upon 2 plus e into 10 square pi upon 2. Only 10 square theta by 2 is value substitute. The value substitute here. Okay, so if I take them, take the LCM 1 plus e, it will come here. 1 plus e minus 1 minus e into 10 square pi upon 2 whole divided by this value 1 plus e plus sign in the denominator is 1 minus e into 10 square pi upon 2 ok so this is value of cos theta we are calculating now, again if I apply component dividend rule, let me check what it comes out to. First, the thing is common here, if a sin, sin square theta by 2, cos square theta by 2, if I substitute, it will come as cos square, which you multiply to this, that will give us something. Okay. So, let me do that then, so we have to prove that cos phi is equal to 10 to 2 cos phi is equal to this value. So in terms of cos, we have to convert this for that. Now let me convert that to sin phi cos phi. So this is cos theta here. In terms of cos theta, we have to convert, but this is cos phi. Let me substitute this in terms of sin phi cos phi. So cos theta we are calculating is equal to so 1 plus e into cos square phi by 2. We have taken sin square phi upon cos square phi value of 10 square phi and taking LCM cos square phi it will come out as 1 minus e into sin square phi by 2. Similarly divided by here it is 1 plus e into cos square phi upon 2 plus sin 1 minus e into sin square phi upon 2. Okay, this is the value we have obtained. Let us now take further. So, multiplying this, it will give us minus minus plus e plus e. Okay, so first we will we'll get cos square phi upon 2, 1 into this, minus sin square phi by 2. This is minus sin square phi upon 2. This are taken. What the function? Plus sign, this is cos square e into cos square phi by phi upon 2. For e, let me take common. Cos square phi by 2, it will be minus minus plus e. e. E, we are taking common to plus sin square phi upon 2. We have element the value divided by similarly here, this is cos square phi upon 2 now plus 1 that means sin square phi by 2 plus sin square phi upon 2 here it is plus sin if I take e common then it will be cos square phi upon 2 minus minus e sin square so this is sin square phi upon 2 this is the value of this this is one of the 
possibility is if I convert that into sin cos phi. So the first one also we could convert that into sin phi into cos phi. Okay. No need, there was no need of applying the component of dividend now. Now the point. So this is cos phi here because cos square phi by 2 minus sin square phi by 2 or we know cos square theta minus sin square theta into cos theta. But in this case this is angle half. This is cos square phi by 2 minus sin square phi by 2. This is cos phi. Let me write it as cos phi plus e. Why? Because this is 1 sin square theta plus cos square theta is 1 sin square phi by 2 plus cos square phi by 2 is 1. So 1 here 1 into e is e on divided by e 1 sin square theta plus cos square theta or sin square phi by 2 plus cos square phi by 2 is 1 plus e into this cos phi again into cos phi with the same thing cos phi to cos multiplying but in terms of theta we have to take okay cos phi now we have to cos multiply then we, we will change this in let me write here so it has come out as cos phi plus e divided by plus e cos phi okay now let me cross multiply in terms of cos phi we have to collect it. cos phi we have to prove this so if i multiply this will be cos theta plus e into cos theta this is cos theta into cos phi is equal to cos phi plus e cos phi cos phi i have to collect this is cos phi this is cos phi Take this step to that side. It will be cos theta minus e. So e I have taken this side for so cos theta minus e is equal to this cos phi. If I take common, then this is 1 minus e into cos theta. So this is cos phi. I have taken common this cos phi and this cos phi. This is one here. I have taken this step to that side. It will be cos phi minus e cos theta cos phi. Cos phi I have taken common from these two. So it will be 1 minus e cos theta. Okay, so that is why cos phi therefore is equal to cos phi is equal to this upon this. This is cos theta minus e divided by 1 minus e cos theta cos theta minus e divided by 1 minus e cos theta. Cos phi is finally done. So this is hence good. Even if I, in the first one, previous one, I mean 15 question, this is the same type of question. But there also 10 phi, 10 theta by 2 is given in case of under root a, a. Okay. Now in this case, if given this, sin phi by 2 cos phi by 2 here, substitute Okay, we have to prove this then the same type of question is this okay this is in terms of cos theta we have to prove this in terms of cos phi same value there in this way if i solve that let me so this is the same answer right inside and put we have obtained this value okay so this is the question here without using component of dividend i i think i might have come to error there so this is question done. Let me take 15 question again. There was some mistake there. Let me check that mistake. This is 15 question. Okay, question 15. We, we were given there cos theta. If cos theta is equal to a cos phi, it is cos phi plus b divided by a plus b a plus b cos phi cos phi some mistake occur a cos phi plus b upon a plus b cos phi to prove that 
then we have to prove that 10 theta by 2 is equal to under root of a minus b upon a plus b into 10 by a upon 2. Okay. This we have to prove. This is just reverse of that question. To prove that this is equal to this. So now if I take this and if I prove this, that is also possibility to prove and this is given. If this is given, then this is to be proved change. So and there in that question, this was not given, this this was given, this has to be proved. But in this case, cos theta is given, and we have to prove this at the point. Okay, so let me take the solution of this. Okay, so if it is given cos theta is equal to a into cos phi plus b upon a plus b cos phi, this is given to us. And cos theta, if I convert into 10 phi, let me take 10 theta, sorry, this is cos theta left hand side. If I substitute here 1 minus 10 square theta by 2 upon 1 plus 10 square. Theta by two. So mistake might have occurred. Cos phi value of cos phi I have to substitute this is a into one minus ten square phi by two upon one plus ten square phi upon two. This is plus b four divided by a plus b into one minus ten square phi upon two divided by one plus 10 square 5 upon 2. Now this is the bad thing. Now in the right hand side, okay, we have this. Now this whole is converted into 10 theta and 10 phi by 2. Okay. Now let me cross multiply in the right hand side. To the right hand side, we first prove by applying component Newton. So some mistake might have occurred. Let me prove and let me check that. So first let me solve this right hand side. I'm solving with a into 1 minus. 10 square 5 by 2 plus b into 1 plus 10 square 5 upon 2 all divided by a into this is 1 plus 10 square 5 upon 2 plus b into 1 minus 10 square 5 upon 2 because LCM 1 plus 10 square 5 by 2 cancel out numerator and denominator we will we'll just cancel out that. This is the value P, the right hand side. Okay, now let me apply the component of dividend. Sorry, component of and dividend. Or we can just reverse this. If I reverse this in the middle, then this will be there. Okay, no problem. This is then, there is a possibility. So, this is 1 minus 10 square theta by 2 on the left, left hand side upon 1 plus. 10 square theta by 2. This is the value in the left hand side. We can do this. Now we have to apply component to dividend. Now applying component to and dividend. And dividend. Some mistake. Now let me solve that. So we will then prove that this is or this equal to this. Cos theta, we have taken cos theta in this way and cos phi in this way. Now we are applying component. We will, so we will prove that the value which is coming in cos theta equal to that that will come to each. The left hand side would be 1 minus tan square theta by 2 plus 1 plus tan square theta by 2 upon 1 minus 10 square theta by 2 minus 1 minus 10 square theta by 2. This is coming in negative sign because we just subtract this minus this and this sorry this plus this numerator plus denominator divided by numerator minus denominator. Then we are doing this minus sign change the sign here. Okay, in the numerator, this plus this, 
This is one month span scale. Five upon two. This is five upon two. This is B into one plus ten scale five upon two. Same value. Plus this. This is A into one plus ten scale five upon two. Plus B into one month span scale five upon two divided by this minus this. So this is A into one minus ten square five by two plus B into one plus ten square five by two minus sine of minus T square. This is minus A into one plus ten square five by one minus B into one minus ten square. Okay, in the right hand side, what do we have? Two ten by two ten theta by two ten theta. This is two upon minus one plus one. So this is minus twice ten square theta by two. This we but getting there also no problem. But in this case, let me check. Here it is a plus b positive, a plus b positive. If you are doing twice a plus twice b, then minus a into tens of theta by two, and this is uh, five by two tens square five by two. This is plus a tens square five by two. If you cancel out, and uh, then b into tens square five by two. This value, this is minus b tens square five by two. That will also be cancelled out. So now let me take that as whatever there. One a plus b, and then minus a into this time uh, is ten square pi by two, and this is plus ten square pi by two times the power. Then b into ten square pi by two and minus b into ten square pi by two times the power. Okay, so this is the value in the numerator. The numerator. So do we have a positive plus b positive minus a minus b. Negative, negative, cancel out. Here it is minus a ten square five by two. Here minus a ten square five by two. This is minus twice a ten square five by two. Okay, that was the problem there. Plus plus b into ten square five by two, and this is plus b ten square five. Okay, so I was just to know. Computed error that a can change, but can change now. This is coming. A is also coming here. Minus twice a times square b by five by two plus twice b because b into times square five by two minus minus plus b into times square five by two. This is twice b times square five by two. Okay, this was a mistake. No problem at all. All right. This is minus here in sign. This minus sign. Let me now. Complete this. I mean, there was a mistake. That's what I was thinking about. So this is minus one upon ten square theta by two. We have got this to be cancelled out. Minus one upon ten square theta by two is done with it. Is equal to here. It is to be cancelled out. It will be a plus b upon minus a plus b into ten square. Five by two. This is the left over there. Now see here. If I take this minus sign, multiply this minus sign to that side, it will be b minus a here. Okay, let me take this to b minus a. This will be b minus a upon b plus b in the denominator into ten square five pi upon two are cross multiplied. Taken this to the side. This minus sign make a positive and b negative, so a positive. So this a minus b in the numerator. A minus b here. Why? So because a will become positive this minus sign, and b will become negative. So this a minus b upon a plus b into tan square five by two equal to tan square theta by two. This is theta by two. The value, therefore. Then theta by two is equal to square root of a minus b upon a plus b 
in two seven five years and two. Is that the same same answer? Question number fifteen. Yes, we have to prove that ten theta by two equal to one two of a minus b upon a plus b into ten phi by two. And is that right? Okay, so this is good and good. It was a mistake in case of component of dividend of calculation. Otherwise, I have read the same thing because I have done this number of times. This question. The students asked me this number of times and we did this exactly. So there was a mistake there. A minus B. Okay, this is 10 theta by 2 equal to 1 root of A minus B. Take me square root on both sides. 10 theta by 2 is equal to 10 phi by 2 into 1 root of A minus B. So this is question number 15. Now both are completed. The 16th and 15th question are of similar kind or nature is same but of different type. Let us take now 17th question. Question number 17 now. What did you say? Question number 17. If I take 17th question, prove that. Okay. Prove that we have already written down. Put that under root of two under root of two further under root of two plus two cos eight theta. Okay, this is cos eight theta. And that we have to prove that this is equal to cos theta. Okay, let us take left hand side. Solution. Left hand side is equal to this whole value, which is two under root two further under root two plus two cos eight theta. Okay, so let me take this. Now, if I take two under root two comma in the bracket, we give us one plus cos eight theta. So what do we understand? We understand that since 1 plus cos 2 theta, 1 plus 2 cos 3 theta, if it is 2 theta, then it is half of that angle, that angle, 2 theta then theta, it will be 1 plus cos 8 theta, it will be then 2 cos square 4 theta, right on So this will be, let me write, 2 under root 2, under root side 2 into 2 cos square 4 theta. Now this is square root, then it out it will be 2 into cos square 4 theta. Okay, that will be, let me write here. It should be 2 under root this. Uh, 4 cos square theta, it will be 4, 2 will come out as 4, okay, into cos 4 theta. Four cos 4 theta. So this is 1 plus cos 8 theta, cos 4 is cos square 4 theta, square root cancel out. So that will be, is it 2 plus or something? So here it is under root into 2 plus, it is plus plus I think, 2 plus, okay. So let us say this is 4 into cos 4 theta. It has come out 2 into 2, 4, cos 4 theta under this point. Again, cos 4 theta, if I add 2 or subtract 2, only cos theta is coming. That means 2 plus 2 cos theta, which is nothing but I think is 2 plus. It is 2 plus. This kind of question is there. We not this kind, but it is plus sign here. Just like 2 plus 2. Okay, so in the first case, it has come out as, I'm sorry, this 2, two plus 2 cos 4 theta it has come out. 
So what is the problem here? This is this plus plus this plus plus sign. Sorry, this is plus sign plus sign here plus sign here. Only then this question. I think this question is mistaken. It will be two plus under root this plus. Now from inside we have got two cos four root because this two is being cancelled out and cos square four theta will be cos four theta. Again we have taken two common. This will give us two plus from inside under this root. This is two if I take common. This will be one plus. Cos four theta. Side one is two. So it will give us under the square root two plus under the square root two into one plus cos four theta is two cos square two theta under the square root multiplied. And this will just will give us further two plus out of this two into two. Four will come out as a two. The cos square two theta means cos two theta. Again, two common. Let me take this here. So it is under the square root now two plus. Okay, if I take two common in this bracket, it will be now one plus cos two theta. It will give us under the square root two. This is one plus cos two theta. That is two cos square theta by two theta theta cos. Two cos square theta. It will come out as two into cos theta. This is the right hand side. And sorry, this question was wrongly written. This is plus plus sign. Now it's okay. So this two cos theta. But the plus without plus sign, the question cannot be solved. Okay. This is question number seventeen. We have completed. But we take. Eighteenth question. Question number now. Eighteenth one. Okay, that I check this if I have completed F. The school is asking this one. It means this question is like this. Multiplied by plus. Or question number eighteen. Okay, question eighteen says prove that. Prove that sine square. Six x minus sine square four x is equal to what is that? We are given here sine ten x sine of ten x into sine of two x. Okay, so we have to do here. Let us take left hand side. Left hand side is equal to sine square six x minus sine square four x. This is a plus b a minus b. This is solution we have. This is a square minus b square. Means a square minus b square equal to a minus b into a plus b. That is there. Similarly, we do this sine six x minus sine four x in one bracket. And the bracket sine four six x plus sine four x. Okay, so. This we have. Let me remove this. This is sine four x. What the sine c minus sine two? What is that? This is two cos c plus d by two. That means ten six x plus four x into into sine six x minus four x. Try to understand. Into this two into. Sine sine c plus sine d. This is two into sine six x plus four x upon two into cos six x minus four x upon two. This is sine c plus sine d. Two sine first, then cos. That is the point here. You understand? It will give us two to the four by four here. This is cos five x six x plus four x upon two plus five x into sine. 2x upon 2. That means x only into sine 5x. Plus 6x plus 4x upon 2 is sine 5x. Upon 4. This is into cos 2x upon 2 is x only. We should be able to write it as 2 into sine 5x 
into four sizes. This is one point. This is two. Sine x is cos x. Now we know two two sines, theta and cos theta. Two sines and theta. It is similar to here. This is angle same. Sine five x into cos five x twice. This is nothing but sine ten x. Sine two into five x that is ten x. Into this is sine two x. This is right hand side. The same right hand side we have obtained here. Okay. This is question number eighteen. We have completed now. Let me take the next question. Nineteen. What does it just say? Let me see. Okay, now question number nineteen. Saying what? Okay, so this is question number nineteen. Let me talk about. Now nineteen is proved that cos theta. Okay, this is proved here. Then we have already written down to prove prove the following. To prove that cos theta. Cos two theta, cos four theta, and right. Dot dot. Up to cos of two base power n minus one into theta. Okay, it is equal to sine of two base power n into theta divided by two base power n into sine theta. Okay, so this we have to prove here. Got the point? This is cos theta into this. Now, if I take left hand side, let me take left hand side here. Solution. Left hand side is this value cos theta cos two theta cos two theta, and so on. This is up to cos twice n minus one into theta. Okay, this is left hand side. If I just multiply this uh, by sine theta and divide by sine theta, it will be let me take one point two sine theta. I have it now. Into let me write in the numerator of two sine theta. Cos theta is already there. Into other values for two theta. Into cos four theta, and so on up to cos two raised power n minus one into theta. Okay, what is give give just this is sine two theta. Okay, so this is step is one point two sine 